to many youth of this county. Thank you, Hezron Kimari, for that. It's important indeed to preserve our culture. But then to matters innovation now, and uh, students at Nyeri National Polytechnic have invented a solar smart car which uses solar energy. The learners say this is part of their contribution to fight climate change as well as tackle the rising fuel prices. Clement Masumbo toured their workshop and now reports. From a distance, one will be mistaken to think this is a tuk-tuk, which are mostly used in urban areas for transportation. But no, this is a solar-powered smart car invented by the students at the Nyeri National Polytechnic. Making a solar-powered car or earning a solar-powered car will help one to manage uh, the, the amounts they are earning, not to go to the fuels, but to be in their pockets or doing other projects. Dennis Mudoni says pollution caused by cars that use fuel as well as the high cost of fuel in Kenya were the motive behind this innovation. And the motive behind coming up with the solar powered car was uh, one, uh, to do away with the pollution, the air pollution caused by these uh, diesel or the petrol engines uh, in this country. Uh, secondly, uh, the the high cost of uh, purchasing a car and maintenance. The reason one can come for this one is it, it because the cost of maintenance is very low. As you can see, it has very few moving parts, more than the other diesel or petrol vehicles. And then, after buying it, you will nev never dig deep to your pockets buying for fuel. When fully charged, the car goes for a distance of 100 kilometers at a maximum speed of 60 kilometers per hour. The car has the capacity to carry a load of 800 kilograms. Oh, when it is fully charged, it can go for 100 kilometers. And then the speed which it can go with, it is 60 kilometers per hour. It can carry about uh, 800 k k kgs. We realize that the cost of, oil, cost of oil is becoming very high. And also there is a lot of pollution regarding to the usage of the diesel and the petrol. But it is not only the solar-powered smart car. The learners here have also invented a digital accident controller, a device that they say will be crucial in reducing accidents on our roads, especially at blind spots. The device works with a pressure sensor and sends an alert to the driver on the opposite side by lighting bulbs. So when the car approaches the pressure sensor, it works at a, under the detection of the weight of the vehicle. So when it is pressed down, the light bulb on the opposite lane, it lights up. So basically, our digital accident controller helps the drivers to unlock the bright areas are basically on our corners. Yeah, it really indicates when the oncoming traffic is there and alerts the other driver on the other end that there is an oncoming traffic. Wamboy says if the government through National Transport and Safety Authority, NTSA, would buy the idea, it would help a great deal in reducing road accidents, which had claimed at least 1,000 lives between January and April this year. Well that creativity is thinking up new things but innovation is now doing new things that is exactly what learners here at the Nyeri National Polytechnic have done and come up with this solar powered smart car which they say is environmental friendly Clement Masombo KTN News at the Nyeri National Polytechnic Nyeri County from Nyeri head to Nyahuru police station well